Hey everyone, this is Bass Fisherman143 and I'm at the private lake down the road from my house again and I just caught a 13 inch bullhead. So hopefully I'm back with more fish for you guys. Well, I just caught another bullhead. This one's a little bit smaller but um, he's about, um, I'd say close to 12 inches. There's, um, as you can see on his back, I'll try to get a, there's a big gash. That, that makes me think that there's some sort of pike or something in here. I don't think a bass would do that, but I don't know, who knows. So, I'm going to keep fishing. Hopefully I'll catch some more. Third pretty good sized bullhead of the day. He's, um, 13 inches, just like the first one I caught. So I'm gonna release him. I gotta. I'm gonna have to go soon. So this might be my last fish, but I'll take a couple more casts. Hey everyone, it's up. Uh, Bass Fisherman 143 here, and I'm at a new place for you guys. Um, oh, okay. Uh, it's a, it's a creek kind of near my house, and I just caught a, uh, it's a, he's kind of small sized carp, but it's a carp all the same. I'll measure him for you guys. Hey guys, I just caught a 30 inch master angler carp. He is a hog. Oh man, I, he, what happened is he broke, he actually broke the line and I could see the line trailing in the water so I grabbed the line and I hand reeled it until I could grab the actual fish. And as you can see, the bank's really steep so I had to like climb up that bank. I kind of moved spots too so 